hopefully not, but this may be the last drive out for us with uh, Porsche Vision 16, because as you will already know, unfortunately I've sold the 993 now, unfortunately, unfortunately, whichever way you look at it. I've had the car since 2008, and it was time to sell to get me into my next car, which you'll see coming up on the channel in the future, but uh, let's just say it's something very exciting. I've had the 993 since 2008, so to get into the car that I, that I want to be in, um, literally pretty much before I die, I've not died, but you know, obviously age is progressing and everything else, so I need to, um, you know, if I'm going to buy this car, then now's the time really. And I'd be very, very sad to see the 993 go, but you know, needs must. So we're driving down to the Avalon Drive with a group of the Region 16 Porsche enthusiasts, Porsche owners. And uh, hopefully this won't be the last drive out of Region 16, but it's possible that it will be. Hopefully it's a good one. And we're not in the 993, we're in the Abarth, uh, which is my daily driver. The reason for that, obviously, because the car's promised to another. And I'm not going to put any miles on it and two miles on it and take any chances with the car for obvious reasons. So we'll sign out from here and uh, we'll pick you up later on the journey. So I'm here with Stuart and we've just arrived at the Honey Cafe, as you can see in the background. And we've just stopped here for a comfort and a coffee break. So um, Stuart, I'm just going to ask Stuart a few questions about the trip. So Stuart, what is the background to this trip and what is the actual route that we're going to be taking and the, and the end destination? Well, uh, to be honest, with COVID and everything, we haven't been out much this year. And um, we did a trial sort of run a few weeks ago to a caffeine machine, but this is a much larger scale um, going on up to Elan Valley. I just thought we'd get a big run in, good days driving, scenic routes, and um, see what happens. We've been, we've been here before on a different route. Um, we've been to Elan Valley on a different route. And uh, yeah, it's just putting a few things together and having a good day. And just to qualify, this is the Porsche Owners Club, so Stuart is one of the regional coordinators for Region 16. So how many cars have you got today? How many, how many people have been able to join us on this trip? Uh, we were going to have 10 Porsches, but um, one of them sold his, so he didn't want to bring it out. <laughs> 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 so we've actually got... got I, let it in, I let it in on top of that, guys, <laughs> why, why my car may be sold. <laughs> so uh, so we got, yeah, we got nine Porsches um, and a Fiat. <laughs> well, that's my Fiat bath. <laughs> yeah, it is a bath. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, as the club's a business, we've got our, the club's got their own COVID risk assessments. Covers 15 cars, so we could have hired a few extra, but I think 10's a, is a cracking group and keep everybody together, and have a good time. What difficulties have you found with coordinating the route? Because I know there's a lot of difficulties with some of the roads being changed or closed off. Um, the the roads not too bad, although. We've just encountered a, a road closure today. The sat nav picks it up and, and does a does a sort of a detour. But the, the main thing is the is the venues like this place closing down their tables, you know, socially distancing and keeping safe. Some some cafes are closing today. We weren't going to come to Bronley's. We were going to come to Krakow, but they're doing a stop take today. So oh, wow. <laughs> so it's it's quite a headache, but um, it's it's good fun. And I notice there's quite a few um, restrictions that's been put on at this cafe today. For example, you've got a definitive route where you're going on the left-hand side and you come in on the other side when you come out. And you've got queuing for the toilets and queuing for, for um, coffees and for any food that you want to order. So this is the sign of the times that we're living at the moment with COVID. Where are we going on to from here? We dropped in on it a couple of years ago on a, on a trip to North Wales, going up to Elan Valley Visitor Centre. So we sort of already knew this was a good venue to go to. They've closed their tables right down, so in, inside they've only got six tables. So that's going to be busy there. But luckily the weather is kind to us and um, we can sit outside and, and make most of that. So we'll close out from here at the Honey Cafe on our coffee break and we'll pick up later on in the journey. Thank you very much, Stuart. Thank you. Thank you. We'll Cheers. do our elbow Cheers. shake. Cheers, Rich. COVID compliant.
arrived at our second destination and this is the Alain Visitor Centre. This is a beautiful area as you can see. We've got this as a backdrop. We're having some lunch here and then we'll move on to our next destination. Unfortunately, on our way back from the last stop at the um, at the Costa Coffee, and Stuart, um, one of our Region 16 organisers, his car's broken down, no drive at all. And what happened, Stuart, on the way back? Um, I was just uh, accelerating, uh, changed up to fifth, and just revs went through the roof, um, so we've got no no drive or anything. So changed down to fourth, back down to third. And Nothing at all. And I believe you've got the AA coming out, yeah, so we should be coming out and picking you up soon. Yeah, good old AA. <laughs> <laughs> what would you do without our services, our AA services? Right. 
So unfortunately a sad end to the end of the day, but it's been a great day and fantastic weather. One of the best days for weather for the year really. And uh, fortunate that we've been able to be just inside the COVID restrictions. We're down to a maximum of six in a group um, from tomorrow. So uh, the restrictions hit tomorrow, so we're just inside that restriction. And uh, it's unfortunate this is, um, this is closing out the day today, but these things happen. So to close out for the day, Thanks a lot for watching guys. Please make sure you subscribe, share the links and share the channel to, to all your friends and relatives. And we'll see you in the next video.